Apparently, there's a secret door somewhere in this magma island that has a really cool weapon. Uh, Maya, do you know where it is? Nope, he does not know. Oh, can I see it? Is that a door? I found it. Living skeleton. Oh, spooky. Hidden sword dealer. Which sword would you like to purchase? The soul cane. For 750k, purchase. That one was true. I'm a noob when it comes to blocks fruits. And in my previous blocks fruits video, I sailed all across the first sea, but I know I missed some hidden Easter eggs. Like how there's apparently Sanji hiding somewhere on this pirate village island. What? Like where? I only see Bobby. I heard he was like in a wall somewhere. Oh, wait, how did I not see this the first time? It's like a straight up door. And we're going in. Dark step teacher. I'd like to learn dark step for 150k. There we go. Secret number two. That's true. Now we have the dark step. Hold on. Let me test it out on this noob. Flying kick. That's pretty good. So today I'm going to be finding every secret in the first sea and seeing if they're all true. Apparently, you can gift yourself a permanent devil fruit now. Gift light fruit. Where am I? Oh, store in inventory. I can just store a light fruit in my inventory? What's there? That one's true. And then if anybody likes my videos, I'll get a free permanent life fruit. This guy here called Project LV says yes. Where is he? I've got a fruit for him. Come here, Project LV. Guess what you get because you're a fan of the channel? You get yourself a permanent light fruit. He said, did you give me that? <laughs> Right, moving on to the next secret. While I'm heading to the next secret, like that guy, you've got to subscribe to the channel and help me speed run to 200k subs. Apparently, there's like a secret hidden area through here that I've never... What? You can break that? Whoa! A chest? Yoink. Yoink. More chests? What? There's eight chests? Well, that's some free money. What's this guy doing? Get away from me. The problem is now solved. Oh, hi, Usopp. I think one of these secrets has something to do with you later on in the video. But for now, we're off to the underwater city. So for this next secret, if I head into this whirlpool and takes me underwater, then I should be able to find a new fighting style, I think. I don't know where it was, though. I believe they said behind these fishmen commandos, though. Oh, yep, that's yes, definitely sir. a door. Let me in. Water Kung Fu teacher. Would you like to learn the water Kung Fu style? Yes, please. And there we go. We've got a new fighting style. Oh, and it looks good. I gotta test this out. Fishman commando, take this. Water Kung Fu. <laughs> it's working. I'm beating him with his own skills. Boom, level 400. He should be a level 100. He was that weak. So for the next secret, there is apparently like a hidden door on one of these windmills. I spent so much time going around this before, so they must be trolling. Oh, I'm getting somewhere. Nope, I'm just running up the wall, apparently. Wait, there's really no secrets here? What about on top? Let me in. That one was a fail. I've still got two more windmills to check, though. Nope. No hidden doors on this windmill. The final windmill. Let's test. Oh! Oh, no, I got stuck. Hey! You stop that. Maybe he's trying to stop me on purpose. I just look like I'm crazy because I got lied to. There's nothing in here. That secret is false. And the next secret says that there is a hidden door in Middletown. Middletown, you better not be lying to me. Hidden door. Let me in. That door is fake. What about this door up here? That door is also fake. Let me in. What about the cathedral? Anything in here? Nope. Oh, I've got a 22k bounty? I'm wanted dead or alive. And they'll never take me alive. Oh my god, I found it. Robot Mega Enhancement Editor. Visual stage changed. What does that even mean? I've changed it again. I, I don't understand what they mean. Robot Mega. He just said K. <laughs> that is all, just K. Now we've got to head back to the Sky Islands because apparently there is another secret waiting for us. But this time, we need to go on the lower parts of the Skylands. Now, I was told that this next one is another fighting style NPC, which I'm not complaining about. Give me all the fighting styles because I didn't find any at all the first time I played this. I see a question mark. You think you can hide that from me? Mad science. I can learn the power of electric. Yes, please. Oh, I've got some glowing fists now. I look good. There is supposedly another hidden NPC somewhere up here, but like, I don't see any. Hello, NPCs? Are they inside a house somewhere? Oh, no, but I found the other secret, which is that there's a hidden code in the top of this building. Wait, I gotta try this. Food 10. And I earned one singular dollar from that code. Wow, I'm rich now. Let's go. But this other thing about there being a hidden NPC up here, that's just completely false. I don't see anybody. No hidden NPCs up here. Oh, wait, Yoshi. There's a Mario character up here. Oh, I can buy the Tomoe ring accessory for 500k. So there was a hidden NPC up here. And now I can look like Enel. But I prefer my cool shades. My cool shades are way cooler. So that myth is actually correct. I am so shocked how I haven't seen any of these people while just like playing through the first time. But you know what? That's fine. Apparently, I am just completely blind. Next up, we are off back to the underwater city area because there is supposedly something we missed. Like this secret is supposed to be very cool as well. They said for this secret that it's just like a hidden secret area somewhere. I've already found a secret area though. So it's like over here. Oh, is it on top of one of these things maybe? Any secrets? Nope, just a plant. Oh, maybe it's over that way. On top of the building, it's gotta be. Still nothing? Well, just about the most secretive thing I've found for this one is a diamond chest. So this one's definitely not true. This next secret is apparently there's a hidden way to get like inside of this pyramid, which doesn't really make any sense. I don't see a hidden way in. I'm looking for like a secret door. Give me that. No way. It was underneath the treasure chest. I mean, they did say it was underneath something. So that makes sense. So if I go through here and then take a 
right? Wait, I'm inside. Oh, hello, Hassan. I'm not ready yet. Go home. Oh, I need to have some stats into sword so I can get the swordsman hat for 150k. Sure. Oh, it looks drippy. Look at that. But moving on, we've got other places to be and more clothing to obtain. Now, I completely <laughs> lost count of what secret we're actually on, but supposedly in one of these towers in Marine Fort, there is a secret. Which tower is it? And what is inside? Wait, I've got some revenge to get real quick. Vice Admiral guy, I'm sorry, but you just got to go down. It's nothing personal. Boom. You were, you gave me so much trouble when I played through this game. I just have to get revenge. Easy. Moving on. Why'd that tower look lighter than all the other ones? That's because it has the secret inside. Oh, hello, Parlus. Lol, dude, I just bought this black cape for 100k Robux. I'll take it for 50k. What a deal. <laughs> I just absolutely scammed that guy. I'm out of here. We need to run away. This secret door here can only be opened by using Yoru. And I don't have that. So I can't get in. So this one's true, but we'll have to check it out when we actually unlock Yoru. But for now, we need to head to the prison because there is a secret NPC on there that not many people see. What about this guy is a hidden NPC? He's way more like an in the open NPC. So I guess this is technically a secret, but I can remove my blocks fruit for 50k. No, don't steal my light fruit from me. I want to leave here right now. This next secret that I'm going to right now, we have all heard of. We all know this one and we all have it. And if you don't have this, then you're massively behind everybody else. You're basically playing this game crippled. And that is the secret cave on the frozen village with Rayleigh, the ability teacher. If you don't have these abilities, then you're massively behind. Now to actually do our next secret here with Usopp, we can't because we need to become the strongest pirate to ever live. So we need to go to a completely different island. So I'm back on the jungle island and apparently there's some like hidden pressure place that I can stand on. Oh, there's one. How did I not see that before? I think I'm lacking a few brain cells, but we're going to find all these pressure places. Then we'll be able to see how we become the strongest pirate. There is pad number two. It was hidden in a bush. Aha, it was hidden on the tree. That's the next one. I can't see where this next one is. They don't make this easy. This game's hardcore. Is this the next one? Have I found it? Boom. And that should be all five of the buttons. And since we got all five buttons, we should have opened up a secret room. Oh yeah, there is. Wait, this is so cool. It's a riddle. I'll just take the torch and be on my way. We're off back to the desert. Now we're going to use this torch in one of these houses. Like, hello? hello? Anybody home? I promise I'm not trying to burn your house down. Just let me in. What about this house? It's like under... Oh, greetings. Anybody home? I just want to burn your house down. Oh, it worked. And now we've got a golden cup. If power you seek, fill the cup from a leak. So we're off to the snowy area. I'm like Indiana Jones going through all my different quests to figure stuff out. All right, I need a leak. Hey, you. Give me a leak. What do I need to do? Like melt him? Oh, my cup is still empty. What are you, Yeti? Nope, he just hurts me. Really? Can you like spit in it or something? That should be like holy water, right? Oh, a leak. Oh, it's full. I've done it. So where do I go now? Does anybody want to drink the water? Do you want to drink it? Oh, he gives a quest. Oh, a sick man. Here, sick man. Take this. There we go. He's been helped. And now he's telling me to go to the pirate village. This secret to get observation hacky is a lot of effort. Are you the one I'm searching for? The one that I've been searching for for ages? The rich man? Thanks for helping my father. Yes, I gotta go take down the mob leader. Where is the mob leader? So the mob leader is supposedly on a hidden island back here. Wait, what? How have I never seen this island before? I guess when you're just speed running through the game, you don't like check out all these things. It's like a hidden den. Anybody home? Oh, hello there, mob leader. I am gonna test out my new soul cane that I got from the very first secret. Oh, it's pretty cool. And we'll grab the diamond chest as well. I've stolen his booty because I'm a pirate and that's what we do. Rich man, I defeated the guy. Oh, I got a relic. Ooh, it's like a totem of undying from Minecraft. Now I need to head back to the jungle and prepare for my final battle. I think this relic goes near the blocks for dealer cousin from what I remember reading. Aha, yep, it goes there. Oh, and here he is. Saber expert level 200. I don't really have to worry because I'm massively over leveled, but he could still be a threat. Oh, he's definitely still a threat. Wait, why does he hurt? I'm level 700 and he's destroying me. Truly a raid boss. Yes. Item drop saber. We got his legendary sword, a sword that carries many burdens. But before we go and get observation hacky, there is one more secret that we need to go check out. And a couple of people in my comments told me that this secret gives you a dark blade for like way less than it's supposed to be. So I want to check this out. Apparently this dog kennel here. Yeah, sure. You can have 97 Robux. Wait, what? He just insulted me. I guess never to trust the people in my comments ever again. That one is false. I'm back at Sky Pier is up. We're going to see if doing that entire Shanks quest has made us a strong enough pirate in the first sea. Yes, I can learn observation hockey. It costs 750k. I can't learn observation hockey. I'm poor. I need to go for grind some bosses. Die, NL. Yes, I've got enough money now. I can go buy observation hockey. Give me my hockey. I have learned observation hockey. We've got to test this. Oh, I can now observe. I can see things at really close range, but I can. So that means we have discovered every single secret in the first sea. So I'm now ready to take on the second sea. I think. 